Hello! It's gig day and once again Dave's being weird in the background of my videos. One day a compilation is going to come out of like Dave he, being weird. He switches weird. on the minute you turn your camera on he turns into that. He's like totally normal <laughs> or fine and then I turn the camera on and he's just that. <laughs> anyway tonight we're playing once again at the Riverhead Theatre so you wait your entire career to play at a theatre and then three come along all in one go. Um, this is for Guitar Mageddon, so there's going to be a lot of uh, guitaring going on for all you bass fans. Drumageddon. Drumageddon. Is what it's going to be. Bassageddon. <laughs> Bassageddon. <laughs> I would have that. Um, and yeah, cool poster. The guy's writing a comment on the poster, as you do. It's a guitarist thing, I think. <laughs> um, this oh, is actually happening in mid-October, but I don't think this video is going to go out until November or December. And I've got another one coming out that is going to be filmed in October and isn't coming out till next year. It's because I'm ahead, <laughs> I'm ahead as Dave's head pops up. So yeah, hopefully you enjoy this vlog. This is my first vlog on a new camera, so let me know if looking it looks Looking dead okay. good, isn't it? Looking it's smart. Yeah. Proper smart. That won't look as good on my laptop, I don't think. <laughs> No. no. Make sure you put it to 4K. Yeah. Put your headphones in, mate. Can't you can see all my taste buds. Can't hear the bass if you don't put your headphones in. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. If you don't put your headphones in, you definitely won't hear the bass. Yeah. Good headphones as well. Yeah. Invest. Invest. If you want the bass, you have to work for it. Yeah. Yeah. In a vest. In a, in vest. a vest. Preferably a string one. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not picture Dave in a string vest. Why not? <laughs> Anyway, we're going to go for a walk by the canals now. And Rabsy Nesbitt style. Yeah. And uh, what the stains be weird? Yeah, stains down it. <laughs> Egg stains. <laughs> yeah, no wonder it's Halloween. Anyway, see you in a moment when we'll be by the canals. Ah, the sounds of nature. Canal ambience. Look at Tinny the <laughs> They're forcing me to watch myself. Of course, I'm not on the screen now. I'm trying to show you. There I am. Best bass, best bass rig under five hundred pounds. This was a challenge that we had to do. Really won because I judged it, and it was better. Katana wins all. I think the, the yeah, I think the sire and the katana, so it was a mix of both. It was, wasn't it? Yeah, actually, yeah. yeah. Anyway, go and watch the actual video. I've zoomed in really far and haven't zoomed out, so I don't know what my face looks like right now. As usual. <laughs> Thank you. JoeGaskin.com drum lessons now available. <laughs> ah, I messed it up. <laughs> <Crazy. laughs> really? See the bar she's doing. Okay. Do I get now? Follow it along, I think. Okay. Dave has just cooked us the most amazing chicken casserole ever. It was like the nicest thing ever. And uh, he got us to rate it, so go and watch his gig vlog and you'll find out how many stars we rated his meal. But now Dave is hopefully going to come randomly into focus. Right on cue. What's all this? What? We're on the YouTubes. Yeah. I've heard of that. But it's a good way to get your name out there. <laughs> YouTubes. YouTubes. Anyway, we're going to load the van in now. And, um... <laughs> what what I'm is he going to I can see myself on that device. It's there. funny, isn't it? Aye. Very clever. Yeah. 
Oh, he's an ugly sod, isn't he? <laughs> no, he's not. Oh, it's gross. Looks like a gremlin. <laughs> Neil Bog! It's Goblin backwards! I've actually got some ass all over my face. <laughs> Hopefully someone out there is going to know what that's all about. <laughs> they're eating her! And, and then, then they're, they're going to eat me! Oh, oh my god! god. That is one of the <laughs> most <laughs> amazing <laughs> cinematic experiences you will ever have in a film. The Troll 2. Yeah, you could say cinematic yeah. experiences. <laughs> Only closely followed by Birdemic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> anyway, loading time. That was really loud. It's wrong. <laughs> it's in my yeah. ear. <laughs> yeah. What did he say? It's really dusty. Look how dusty they are. <laughs> <laughs> I can see! It's like that weird uh, TV interruption. What was it by that guy? Which uh, one? Do you remember what that was interrupted? He got like born there. Oh, so. the Max Payne Ma thing. Yeah, you that. need like a little thing behind me that's yeah. spinning. Did you not realise how dusty they was? <laughs> <laughs> Hang on. There we go. <laughs> anyway, see you soon. Not much going on on stage. Can't do What's going on I'm on wireless, so I'm about to do a wireless test. is about to meet its father. <laughs> yep. It's not every day you have this behind the stage. It's like something from a horror film. Hi. This is really cool. It smells like paint. Yeah, it does. Like proper paint. There's Dave. Silence, s'il vous plaît. Don't know who that is. That's the Mona Lisa. That's where the Mona Lisa is. We found her. We found her. Oh, we're taking that, aren't we? That's <laughs> worth millions, right? Cool. Now. <laughs> we're back for you oh. later on. I, I don't know who that is, but I quite like him. That's, um, I can't remember his name. People of YouTube, comment below. People, Queenie's yeah. fans, comment yeah. below. Who is it? I, I, I think I know his name. He's probably not, but who knows? That's, that's the creepiest picture I've ever seen. <laughs> It's a Nothing. mirror. Oh, oh yeah. wait, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> There's a clock back here. Stop it. What does this mean? Cave vicate scientia avedi sapere. In the cave, there is a bear. Bear made of science, and he likes sapphires. Do you know, I knew you were going to say sapphire at that one. Really? Yes. I, I am something of a language con well, connoisseur there's, there's myself. Lara Croft. Oh, it actually Winston. is Lara Croft. It's just a Winston there. <laughs> the crossover, you never knew you needed. Right. Inspector Clouseau. I thought that. Et rhum. Et rhum. The mousse. Received a burp upon the head. A burp. A burp. Okay, so have you ever banned us, um... You have a band, uh, well, the main band of uh, soundtrack, and now we've just done our soundtrack, so we're a bit on it. It's quite, it's quite hectic, so filming is a bit difficult. Yeah, um, don't know if you heard Dave saying it's quite hectic out there, so it's a little bit difficult to film at the moment, but filming what we can. And uh, this is quite a cool little behind the scenes thing of like, if you've ever been to a pantomime, 
this is what it looks like, and this is how they get from one side of the stage yes, to the other. So. First, Very cool. Second. Straight in, past the stage, and then down like the little rabbit runs at the side of the, uh, the venue. Mm -hmm. Tripod to see better days. Anyway, let's do this. Ooh-la. <laughs> oh yeah. War of the World reference. This is the backstage oh, Queenie got below there. So this is the backstage area where we were, where me and John Joe did gig here once and we weren't allowed back here by the main actors like no we don't allow them back here. So the steepest back here in the main stage. They're not always on. That is bizarre, you can still hear the stage from here? Yeah, it's really tinny on it. Yeah. And then through here, I think is... Yeah, you okay back there, Queen? Yep, all good. Uh, uh, oh, this, oh is little, this is another stage I've played in here before. This is a, another little kind of part of the theatre. Didn't even know this was in here. Yeah, I played in here before. Wow. Yeah, it's quite cool. It's quite small though. Yeah. Very cool. Um, I don't know what's up those days. It says no public actors, so we can't go that way. Yeah, but we're artists. That is the, uh, what's it called? The entrance way. The foyer, yeah. Foyer, yes. Anyway, nature calls. We're trying to find our way out, but this is the main entrance way. Ah, a Christmas Carol. I think it is those stairs. Is well, it? It's got to be. There's no okay. other way to go. Adventure. Adventure for the cruddy day. We can't find John Joe. I don't know where he's gone. This will come out of the top. There you go. Oh, yeah. Oh, I have come up these ones What's before. Bagseed dressing room one. I can hear John Joe. I can hear John Joe as well. So, what do we have in dressing room one? Me. Yeah. A chair. And me. An ironing board. Yeah, this, this chair's just for my leg. <laughs> the leg chair. So I can look like this. So, you came expecting a show. What you got with me? Just a low life, dirty space marine. <laughs> On his final tour of duty. Well, I've got something to tell you, boy. Or oh, girl, whatever you are. My eyes aren't very good. <laughs> Tense the glasses. Shrap took some shrapnel in the great space war of 4545. It was a bad day. I lost a lot of friends there. Mm -hmm. But I remember it well. You're ready for a show. I'll give you a show. Not terrifying at all. PTSD Space Marine. <laughs> New character. So, mm. gig clothes. Out of focus gig clothes. Ooh. Coat with my inhaler in and earplugs. Sweet things in case we have any sugar drops. Sweet things are made of cheese. Who am I to disagree? Um, Around the world. And bottles of water. Seas. Important. I Dave's gig clothes. Um, and then chocolate. But for afterwards, no chocolate before on stage in case you're singing. Um, crisps and drinks. It's all very interesting here. It's all going on, isn't it? absolutely riveting stuff it's really bizarre because in all the dressing rooms you can actually hear through that speaker everything that's going on on stage i don't know how well the camera's going to pick it up but like literally even just people milling around on stage i can hear everything that's going on but i suppose it makes sense if you're doing pantomimes and stuff like that you want to know you need to know what's going on so really interesting i never would have guessed that was a thing. You can actually hear really well what's going on on the stage. So this is Dan from Loop Cycle.
Okay, we just got off stage. How do you think it went? Went perfectly on shoot. <laughs> You're never gonna get a sensible thing. Like right, Dave does his dead sensible and then we do yours. Amazing. <laughs> yeah, that was great. Really yeah, it was. It. Yeah. yeah. That was fun. Neck and now though. Yep. Well, it's amazing how like, you like, support that. You blast it, don't you? you, just, you I think everything. when it's one set, you just go, don't you? Yeah, yeah. you, you know you've got everything. You know there's no. Yeah, you know you don't. You don't have to hold back, do you? Yeah. It's like right, I'm just going to give it all I've got for uh, 45 minutes. Mega. My arm really aches yeah. now. Yeah, let, me, let me let me let me grab oh, it for you, you, Queens. There you go. Hello. This feels really weird being on my own video and not holding the camera. Yes. But yeah, that was great fun, wasn't it? It was. I loved it. Yeah. yeah. It feels so great playing on that stage as mm. well. The sound on stage is amazing. Yeah, that room sounds um, it sounds really good. It's all look like acoustically treated. Yeah, it's great. And like yeah, proper. It? So like when you're playing you're just like there's nothing you can't hear. It's just nothing you can't hear. There was a bit of weird feedback going on at one point on there. The, the mic was a bit woofy. Oh, I heard that. It was yeah. only for a second, though. It yeah. Was, My yeah. ears kept going a bit distorted. I don't Did know if it was volume. Yeah, I had to take one ear out for a mm. bit. Mm. I'll be deaf tomorrow. Yeah. One what? Ear. Hey? What? Yeah. yeah, this ear. Don't talk to me in that. <laughs> what, that there? Yeah, I went in, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that was mega. It was really good. Warm. Very yeah, warm. Yeah, hotter than last time, I would say. It was hotter than last time. Dave's doing a weird contortionist. It's because I just need to give my arm a little bit second it? rest. No, it's all right. It's fine. Do you want me to have a go? We'll all have go on, on. yeah. Go on, have, a, have a go on it. Oh, <laughs> oh, please don't drop it. I don't have oh, a case yet. Oh, yeah, I've done yet. it in my left hand. <laughs> Up here is Orion's belt. Down, down here, here is Dave's belt. <laughs> I could have gone south quickly. <laughs> My marrow could have come out. Oh, no. Judging by what was happening the earlier today. I think the marrow has been mentioned in everyone's vlog, <laughs> and yet there's like no context to it. Good. Wait, Just... Well, you can't face that, can you? No, you don't. You don't want the context. You don't want to see the marrow. <laughs> I've had the context. <laughs> it was a bit All too much. <laughs> oh, <God>. the context. <laughs> like so yeah, gig went well. <laughs> yeah, it went really, really well. <laughs> totally normal. Yeah. I saw that. I didn't. It's funny because we're facing the screen, so like anything Dave does, I can just see anyway. Boring. <laughs> anyway, get away with my high jinks, man. I kicked. I kicked. Wait. I'm ready. One, two, three, four. Whoa! <laughs> pull the ham. <laughs> pull me hammy. I pull me hammy. That's hammy a crotch ripper. <laughs> Marrow's fallen out. <laughs> oh, no. I ripped me marrow. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. The sun will come out tomorrow. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we sang at the end we of the last one as well. Right. Yeah, the, again, yeah. this probably won't be the last thing you see of the unsheathed gang today. Yeah, gig went really well. Unsheathed. Unsheathed. I'm so childish. <laughs> right, so it's the morning after the gig, and one, I'm knackered because I barely got any sleep, but, you know, it's just part and parcel of doing it, and it is well worth it, especially for a gig like last night, because that was just amazing another one of my favorite gigs i've done uh playing on that stage is amazing like having the room to actually move around is really really nice because quite often you're kind of like crammed in on pub floors and you're like it's cramped and obviously it's probably clear by now that i love to move on stage i'm literally all over the place and i get to actually be on wireless when i play stages like that so i'm very grateful to have that opportunity um, hopefully there will be many more in the future because it's absolutely awesome. Uh, the sound on stage was incredible. Probably the best sound I've ever had on stage, like in a, in order of like hearing things. So hearing Dave clearly, hearing John Joe clearly and me and all the vocals evenly as well. It was really, really nice because I'm quite often used to just kind of making do with what I can hear and then like taking certain cues 
from what I can hear and kind of working off them. But to have a whole picture of what we actually sound like on stage all together is just amazing. And there's definitely something to be said for that. Uh, the energy was amazing again, as usual, last, like last time we played there. Sorry if I'm tripping over my words, it's because I'm really tired um, and it's first thing in the morning. But yeah, just incredible gig so massive massive thank you to colossus for having us on guitar armageddon um and the riverhead theater and the sound guy because he was amazing um absolutely loved loop cycles set i think i'm now one of his biggest fans it was amazing right up my street um and massive thank you to everyone who helped out as well last night who was on stage hand and all sorts so yeah Absolutely loved it. Hopefully you enjoyed this gig vlog as much as I enjoyed making it. Um, hopefully you enjoyed the gig. And if you do fancy coming to see the trio live, you could get in the background of a photo because last night we were going to take a photo of everyone behind us in the theatre, but it just totally slipped our mind. So that's going to be something that will be happening in the future. Um, so if you do come to a trio gig, you could be in a photo with us and get shared around. So please come to one of our gigs. It's well worth it. I promise you, not just for the photo. Um, and yeah, we, well, especially I love getting to chat to people after gigs. I know, uh, Dave can be quite shy. I don't know so much about John Joe, but he, he's generally very chatty anyway but we're all lovely people so if you come to a gig we would absolutely love to chat with you and yeah thank you very much for watching if you enjoyed this video please consider becoming a patron at patreon um and also i'll put a link for my band camp in the description and the trio's album so every song you hear in this video is available on Bandcamp. so thank you very much and i will see you next time bye